Uh, just uh, you know, an unbelievable college baseball game, and you know, uh, you could uh, you could tell you know a lot riding on on that game, and uh, both teams I thought played really well and competed for for nine innings. I don't know how long the game was, but uh, uh, four hours it seemed like it was twelve. Um, but uh, just proud of my guys, you know, for hanging in there. Um, you know, we we come out you know uh, with a flurry early. Um, you know, and then, you know, uh, the EV or IV, you know, hung in there and um, all of a sudden started putting up some zeros. I thought Brady did a great job, you know, mixing early. Uh, but when you make a mistake to, to that good offense, you know, they, they make you pay. Uh, and we were able to extend the lead, obviously. A uh, huge inning, you know, Caracy getting out of the, uh, I guess, the seventh after they got a couple guys on no outs. Uh, but, uh, you know, we can make it exciting. And uh, and we did, but just uh, you know, proud of my guys for hanging in there. Mike is pitching against this team about trying to be perfect with a perfect strike. I really think that's the mistake. I think uh, it's to be aggressive, but I think to be you know successful. Obviously, uh, what Brady had uh, when he was successful was being able to mix um, all three of his pitches. When he wasn't able to do that, when he got in predictable counts, um, you know they're, they're much better, which most offenses are. But um, you know, obviously, uh, they're one of the best offenses in the country. Houston, what was it like for you? Well, you know, uh, new Crazy in the ninth inning. There's not a better person you want on the mound there. Um, and then Greer after going in after him, and uh, finally hearing my name called. Uh, you know, it, it's exciting because that's that's the first time I've ever come in uh, in the ninth inning for a game. I think at any point in my career, and uh, <coughs> you know, just yeah, you know, that's a good good club over there, and uh, you know, just come in and make my pitches. Will talk about the locker room after an emotional win. Um, uh, I'm guessing it's it's exciting right now. I hadn't been in there yet, but uh, <laughs> you didn't know you made it come uh, here. Yeah, but I'm I'm sure it's excited. Uh, it was a big win for us, you know, getting uh, getting that momentum into the uh, the finals tomorrow. So um, I'm pretty sure we're we're ready for it. Well, you guys got out hit, out homer, and that kind of thing, but y'all scored runs in different ways. Mm -hmm. what, what do you think of uh, the offensive performance today? Uh, I think we we uh, we hung in there. You know, we we found ways to to score. You know, wh whether it was walks, you know, timely hits, uh, sack flies, anything like that. You know, it's just all about the timely hits. And, you know, um, we found ways to score. So that's, that's what I think about it. Well, it kind of gets lost with that big play with 10 strikes out. You guys show them. Catcher just kind of lets the ball get bombed. What did you see there? Uh, I was, you know, I was kind of thinking that the pitch before, you know, if it gets 3-2 and we have to, uh, you know, a ball gets in the dirt, I'm, I'm going to score no matter what. So, uh, you know, I saw it happen and I just, I just went for it.